mother, Sonali Bengwe, to give us her experience and thoughts on the Tuffy's campaign. Great to see so many of you here. Uh, first of all, thank you, Mr. Gaurav and Dr. Dika. And I'm so happy to be sitting here next to Dr. Bernali, who I must say is stunning. I've been admiring her. You know, I've been wanting to ask her, what is it that you're wearing in your bun? It's so pretty and beautiful eyes. And you just said something about reversing uh, the age, 62 and 26. I think you're 26 years old. You're definitely not 62. The energy is that of a 26 year old. It's amazing. And I really hope I can always live young in my head the way you are. And I think that also comes from having a purpose in life, which you do. And that's what keeps you going. And that is a great lesson that I'm going to take back with me today. But we're here for the campaign that Sipla is running for kids. The initiative is called Toughies. I have been part of Sipla's uh, earlier campaigns also. And I agree with Dr. Bernal. They were targeted towards the parents, towards the elders. And this campaign is targeted towards the children. You know, we always, um, we don't give our children enough credit. Or we don't uh, believe the, how much they can understand and grasp a situation. Uh, but they are very mature and when you, they, they, they put in a position and if you can explain things to them, they get it very quickly and they rise to the occasion. That's been my experience where when I went through my illness and when I explained that to my son, he more than rose to the occasion, understood exactly what I was talking about. In fact, became one of my biggest support systems in that. And I find that when you treat your children, when you talk to them as adults, because you might, you you know, you might need a little bit longer to explain a thing rather than saying, Bade ho jaunge to samaj mein aega. That statement is just not the thing. The moment you can take those five minutes extra and explain the thing to a child, I have realized that you have a more uh, understanding teenager. If you've done that with your child in the younger age, your teenage years are easier because your child understands. They, they, they learn to, uh, they understand the other side of it. They understand other's point of view. And suddenly the bond between the parent and the child is also much better. My child had asthma and you were right. It was, though I was in the city with everything going on, it was a tough call to take because so many myths, there's so many things that people tell you and it's like, you know, don't put them on medication. It's, they're going to start putting on weight. They will not have the strength. There's so many myths about, about it. Um, fortunately or unfortunately for me, I had a father who was asthmatic. And my childhood went in seeing horrifying asthma attacks. Because an asthma attack, a full blown, any parent who has seen it or anybody who has asthma in the family, when you get a full blown asthma attack, when you can't breathe, that's the Not seeing, not being able to breathe. You just realize how it, there's nothing in life without breath. And then, and a person who's breathless and you can't do anything and you can see 